Hi guys, uh, thanks for tuning into my channel today. I just thought I'd uh, let you know that if you have the current model 2019 CB500X, like this one here, what I have just uh, received from the post from England should be of great benefit to you. So I've been waiting roughly a week for it to arrive and finally arrived today. So like I said, you got the 2019 CB500X, stay tuned. Now I'll give you a little bit of a hint or a rundown what's on the package, so the save all suspense. It's a new anti-glare uh, type of a plastic coating which goes over the display panel on the 2019 to stop reflection and that gives you a good idea now how it really is in a reflection in the shade. And you can see once it's turned on it's a lot harder to read. In the shade yes, but in the thin direct sunlight no. Now when I contacted UK to see about it, uh, roughly uh, $20 for a pack of two. The only problem was it was included free postage. Well, that really wasn't a problem, but it included free postage. But the postage to get it from the UK to Australia was something like three to four weeks. So uh, I actually rang the guy over there in the UK and said, can you do me a, a much faster postage, like an express service? He's, and he's mentioned, yeah, well, I can, but he said uh, it'll be expensive. So to get your two items worth $20, it's going to cost you $45 Australian in post. So I thought to myself, well, uh, sounds a bit expensive. Spend 45 on postage and get for a $20 item. So anyway, I guess there's not much you can do about postage if you want something fast. And I didn't want to wait a month. So to make it worthwhile, not only did I buy mine, I bought at least another half a dozen units which I'm going to do a giveaway on this one if we, whoever wants to subscribe to the channel all they've got to do is uh, go to the back of this uh, video and so we'll go through the fitting of this see how it looks and then at the end of the video or somebody through the video I'll just let you know how we'll go about it and I think I'll put six of these up for a giveaway competition they'll be available uh, to uh, entrance worldwide so if you win it doesn't matter where you live I'll post it out to you. So guys, now we know what's going on, I'll just move this bike back out into the area under the brand and we'll get into fitting this little bit of a screen protector or anti-glare screen protector. I suppose it's a combination of both and see how that goes and see if the results are well worth the, the trouble doing it. They buy a company called Speed Angels and they class them as uh, motorcycle dashboard screen protectors. But in this case, I purchased the anti-glare because, you know, some people have complained there's an anti-glare problem on the uh, 2019 CB500X. It probably is, but I think only under shade conditions, but in direct sunlight. But uh, what we're going to do is, uh, in this giveaway competition, it'll be just the winner gets one screen protector. And uh, we're going to give, or I'm going to give away, actually six screen protectors in total so you just enter on the comment section of this video and you have not subscribed to the channel well naturally if your name's pulled out well it'll be bad luck for you and uh, you know you won't win anything but if you're a subscriber you've got no problems and uh, doesn't matter if you own the bike or not or plan on buying the bike I should say uh, it'll be there for you and we'll soon see how this goes and whether or not it's a um, a good investment for a bike for a cheap outlay for a lot better view so we'll get into that side of it now well guys once you open the package you got this anti-glare panel for the uh, 2019 Honda CB500X it's got an area to look at the front section for the back it also mentions here in full instructions in the instructions you can do a dry fit or a wet fit and uh, I think with a dry fit, like it's just working on anything else where you're putting on stickers, especially like on cars and things like that. If you go for a dry fit, chances are if you don't get it right first time, you're not going to be able to move it around and it'll, it, your chances are you'll bugger it up. I would say in my case I'll um, go for the wet thing, uh, the wet fit with it because I find, you know, it gives you a little bit more room for error. The, uh, you also get with it a little like a plastic type squeegee and a, and a little cloth to clean the front of the display but 
that part I don't think is all that important. You could use a credit card or anything and that, and that's all they put together in the package to make it sort of, I suppose, worth the money. But the most important thing you've got here is really detailed instructions on how to go about it. That should be pretty simple to, uh, or maybe not quite simple to fit, but it should be, shouldn't be that hard, you'd think. So, uh, this part, so... Okay boys, we're under the brander now, so this is what the screen looks like off. That's it on. At this stage naturally we haven't applied the anti-glare material, so uh, this will be a reference later on so we can move back and then check her out from there. Okay guys, just a minute soapy water to clean the screen. I'm using gloves so I don't get fingerprints on the shield protector itself. Use a microfiber cloth to clean it down after that. Hey, that's good. Now we'll remove the top cover and give you the squeegee out. Top cover off, and I'll use this supplied cloth so I'm not running the cardboard squeegee along the new plastic or the coating. But you could use anything there, it's, it'll do the job, I reckon. Besides, either way you look at it, this is just a rough demo, so I have, uh, however it turns out, I've got another spare in there, I can have another crack at later, but at this stage all, all looks good, so uh, it, it's really not hard. So, compared to what I'm usually, you know, if I compare this to, um, on a scale 1 to 10, compared to, like, respraying a car or doing bodywork on a car, well, a class, this is pretty simple. I think all good, and that's about it. Okay, we already now you can see a lot flatter display now, it's taken the glare right of it. So we'll turn the ignition on now and light her up. I've got the camera around, idea, around the opposite side now where it's not shooting into the light. We'll get here, we'll turn her on. And there you can read everything what's on the display where prior to that was more difficult. So we'll push her out into the sun now, have a look at it out there and see how the uh, anti-glare reflection works in direct sunlight. So we'll light her up and see what you think. Yeah. You can read it equally now outside, equal to what it was under there in uh, shade, so it's more uniform now, inside and out. So I think overall that was a success with what was done and um, if you're going to get there and buy one they're only going to cost you $20 you get a pack of two in the pack of twos you can decide if you want anti-glare or straight out gloss I suppose you would call it I think for $20 if you get one sent to Australia you're getting your money's worth it'll help you in a lot of areas and then I think when you get back on this video and look back and forth on before and after you'll know it really does cut, cut down the glare and uh, and that's what its purpose is and uh, people that have bought the 2019 model Honda CB500 X's have co complained about the uh, disastrous play and um, the glare from it so this is one way to eliminate it and uh, it's a probably a cheap way to eliminate it so you know you got onto a mate and you've had both had the bikes and shared it half each 10 bucks each is nothing or you just go and buy the couple and 
and uh, you know party on from there but overall I think uh, pretty good and I'll get out and test it over the next few days and uh, see how she performs long term so if you say is it worth buying I think so and it's a good protector for your screen and uh, well, a lot better protected than just the outright original so uh, we'll see how we go long term with this idea and once again thanks for looking at the video